guys welcome back to my channel so today's video is all about turning yourself from drab to fab in about five to seven minutes that's all okay and you only need six products I chose my most favorite six drugstore products for today obviously you can switch in your products you can add or minus steps that you think uh, you want but this is my go-to quick makeup look when I need to do something there's no foundation only concealer if you're an office going lady uh, you can definitely use this or even for college literally anywhere anytime you want a quick makeup tutorial I think this is a really nice one because you look put together and you're not using so much product so let's quickly jump into the video okay guys so first I see my blemishes right so this is what I want to cover instantly when I look into the mirror and also all these little tiny tiny spots that I have that's it I'm not gonna go all ham so for that um, I'm sure you guys already know this is my favorite favorite concealer at the moment this is the LA girl pro conceal I'm in the shade pure beige so what I'm going to do is just put a little bit of concealer. Uh, now because this is sort of uh, a tutorial where you are going to be stepping out and stuff, I'm just going to put a little bit more on the areas that I have redness on. And to blend this out, either you can blend it with your finger or you can take the pack 272 brush or the pack 169 brush, okay? And what I'm going to do is I'm taking the pack 169 brush and I'm just going to start blending the concealer and covering my dark circles now why I like this concealer in specific you ask is because it is really thin okay it's lightweight you cannot really tell you have concealer on and that's why I love this concealer for everyday use specifically so you're gonna go all over your nose and just like everywhere and just buff it Now, like you can see, it's already concealed, okay? I'm not gonna go all ham and try and make it bright or anything, okay? I'm using the same um, shade concealer or a little bit on the peachier side so that it cancels out my darkness. That is my goal for this routine specifically. And trust me, guys, this literally takes five to seven minutes. You don't even need that much time. You can also take your finger and blend it out. It's faster that way. So now I'm going to take my stippling brush and the reason why is because there are some lines, you can see patches of concealer everywhere. So you want to take that and blend it out. Okay guys, now that we have covered up our dark circles, you can actually see how it's even toned now. To lock it in or set my concealer in place, I'm taking the Maybelline Fit Me Loose Powder. I love this product guys. I've used it a bunch of times and this is such a good powder. I highly recommend this powder if you're looking for a loose powder. I'm I'm actually not in this shade. This is light medium. It's a little too dark for me. So I highly suggest you go for a light or something. You know, it sort of brightens up the face. So anyway, I'm taking light medium for now. If you're on the deeper skin tone, like deeper than me, this will be your shade. To set, I'm taking my pack 134 brush. It's a really nice um, pointy brush. Uh, and I'm just going to go in and just place the powder. I'm just patting the powder. Okay, I'm not going to just sweep the powder because you just put on concealer and it's a little bit wet. So all you want to do is pat. Be very gentle under your eye, okay? So instantly it just mattifies the skin. It's such a beautiful powder. And if you get oily wherever, just like put the powder around. Guys, trust me, you're going to be out of the door in five minutes. It's because I'm explaining. I'm sort of taking it slow to help you understand why we're doing these steps. And if you get oily on your lids, just put a little powder there. This powder is magic, guys. Trust me. It doesn't emphasize your wrinkles. It doesn't emphasize your under eye. You know, those tiny little things that you have here which annoy me a lot. But it's so smooth. It's such a smooth powder. Once we're done with concealer and powder, we're going to move on to the third product, which is eyebrows. So pick any eyebrow uh, product that works for you. I love and have been loving the Lakme and KKK collection. This is the brow definer in graphite. So what I'm going to do is just naturally start filling in my brows. Okay, it's a quick process. I'm done with that I already look a little decent now I'm gonna move on to my lashes okay I'm not gonna put any eyeshadow I'm gonna take the lash sensational by Maybelline this has been my go-to mascara forever um, there are many many amazing mascaras um, in the market so whichever is your favorite go for that and just go crazy with your lashes because that's what makes your eye really stand out 
this instantly gives you a lift can you see that so i'm not wasting my time with mascara that takes so much longer to push up you know this is just like two three it's just so good Okay, so now we're gonna add a little blush. I think blush is so important during the day, like if you're in the office, especially. Um, it just looks good if you're gonna give a presentation or if you have meetings to go to. It just looks very nice and healthy, okay? So for that, I recommend a cream blush. Uh, this is the one I have been loving. This is the Lacme and KKK collection in Peach, Peach Princess. So either you can put it at the back of your hand and just apply it with your finger what I like to do is take a brush again this is a random brush I got from Amazon okay what I like to do is just swirl my brush okay and then go over really really quickly dab it and just can you see the color instantly okay and then just go over it with your finger because mommies don't have time okay mommies and we women don't have time this is our best bet <laughs> so putting a blush sort of uh, ties in the whole look together and makes it look like we put in some effort okay for my sixth and final product is the lips i'm not gonna go crazy with bronzer highlighter nothing no contouring you can do a little bit of nose contour if you're uh, if you want but um, for lips i'm gonna take the nika lipstone lie lip pencil in pillow fight this has been my favorite you can skip lip liner if you don't care about it much but i like to line my lips so really quickly now you can definitely fill it in as well that becomes your lipstick or i have been loving the nika um ultra matte lipsticks one is in mona lisa and nefertiti these are two of my favorite ones nefertiti is a little bit more on the peachy coral side it's like a light nude perfect again for every day and mona lisa has been my favorite it's more on the brownie nude side uh, better for deeper skin tones so i'm gonna take mona lisa and just dab it So that's it guys this is the final result it is super simple just using six products you can use them with your fingers you do not need a whole lot of tools to create this look that's why i love this it's a quick seven minute tutorial i really hope you enjoyed watching this and i really hope i helped you um whatever you feel is missing and you like you can definitely add or minus steps that you prefer uh, this is my preferred go-to look i think it looks really nice and youthful and presentable so thank you so much for joining me and i will see you in my next one Bye guys!